You may remember China's strict one-child policy from years ago. You may remember China's strict one-child policy from years ago. You may remember China's strict one-child policy from years ago. You may remember China's strict one-child policy from years ago. But now the country has a new problem. 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 You may remember China's strict one-child policy from years ago. But now the country has a new problem. You may remember China's strict one-child policy from years ago. But now the country has a new problem. They need families to have more children. They need families to have more children. They need families to have more children. They need families to have more children, but parents are resisting. But parents are resisting. But parents are resisting. But parents are resisting. Janice Mackey Freyer reports from Beijing. Janice Mackey Freyer reports from Beijing. They need families to have more children, but parents are resisting. Janice Mackey Freyer reports from Beijing. They need families to have more children, but parents are resisting. Janice Mackey Freyer reports from Beijing. With boxing lessons, then painting, and ping pong too. With boxing lessons, then painting, and ping pong too. With boxing lessons, then painting, and ping pong too. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy. With boxing lessons, then painting, and ping pong too. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy. With boxing lessons, then painting, and ping pong too. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy. You may remember China's strict one-child policy from years ago, but now the country has a new problem. They need families to have more children, but parents are resisting. Janice Mackey Freyer reports from Beijing. With boxing lessons, then painting, and ping pong too. It's a juggling act for Lily Pung to keep her two kids busy.